So how do they truly feel about you right now? We have the tower. The Knight of Pentacles. The Ten of Pentacles. The Five of Cups. So they know that you are both mirroring each other's energies. You are both going through a divine shake-up. You are both having everything that doesn't serve you, everything that was keeping you tethered to the false matrix and all of the illusions, the density, the suffering that goes along with that is crumbling away. This was a divine intervention with these lightning bolts here. And I feel for many of you, it could be um, from the moment you met each other, this was lightning struck both of you. This is your higher selves, aspects of your higher selves really coming in and being embodied within you both, which is leading to immense awakening. This is the end of an era, an end of that false matrix, the false self. And it's very scary for some of you. This is really happening in very karmic kind of ways, karmic situations with others. Um, it could look like disaster in your lives, but really it's a blessing in disguise. It's removing you both from anything and everything that isn't serving, anything that was fear-based and, you know, holding you back, anything that you were too afraid to confront. The divine is coming in and forcing you both to confront this. Your person loves you so much. They want to be this knight of pentacles, creating this ten of pentacles for you and for themselves and for this connection. This is what you both mirror and provide for each other. Stability. This is rebuilding. This is working hard, planting positive seeds. This is you both embodying your higher dimensional selves, the fifth dimensional energy, because we are these light workers here to uplift the consciousness in this way so this is uh, you know de demolishing i'm seeing like the demolition of a building to build something better um something much more higher consciousness so this person's very dedicated knight of pentacles they want you to feel safe there's this protective energy this is that stability the firm foundation they are creating for you and you are for them so that you can transition you can have a soft landing a safe landing and you're landing in love it's fear and anxiety and suffering and shadow that's being crumbled away um, and it's love. You're going to land on love, so to speak, in love. Um, <clears throat> and they're very dedicated to this, okay? Five of cups, it normally shows three cups spill over. So again, there's this release of the things that aren't serving, but then it normally shows two cups standing upright, which is what you're moving into, the two of cups energy, that divine union. You are uh, the yin and the yang, twin flames, mirrors of each other and it's this immense love that's really woken you both up it's activated your hearts the love it was like lightning struck and suddenly you're awake there was these immediate intense feelings of the most profound love <clears throat> how else do they truly feel about you so they want to help you and this connection through this divine shaker and moving you into deeper levels of harmony, stability, safety. How else do they truly feel? Yeah, look, the bear, protective energy. You make me feel safe to open up. So they've witnessed all the pain that you've been through, all the destruction. Um, you have very similar childhood wounds, I feel, um, as well, about feeling rejected abandoned used and abused that kind of energy all of the suffering from this false matrix all of the suffering when you hadn't fully realized who you truly are so you are working very powerfully as a team to help um, surround each other completely envelop each other in this love it's such a holy love these lightning bolts are you both being uh, plugged into the divine more consciously well you've always been plugged into the divine 
that flow of life force from your soul family and God, but now it's so much more conscious. And um, there's immense progress here, healing within their heart, healing within in your heart and um, moving more into that two of cups energies, having more self-love to be open hearted, expressive. This person, they just want you to thrive. They want you to feel safe in their presence, to open your heart and be your true self because they see you have been like locked up or imprisoned um, in this harsh false matrix where others didn't understand you, but this person understands you. And we have, you make me feel so happy. Look, this is like these pentacles here because they all have this sunshine. This is about the solar plexus chakra, self-esteem, self-confidence. You are both holding back um, your light because I feel like you've been very triggering to a lot of people throughout your life because they haven't wanted to look into their own shadows this is all happening subconsciously so you've been very triggering and you felt from a young age you had to hide your true self away dim your light down um go unnoticed kind of thing but the, you really see each other's light this person sees your beautiful light and you see it within them and this is what you love about each other, your true selves, your souls. Powerful twin flame energy here. And so this is you both moving into so much more confidence. This is you releasing anything that isn't serving. To begin with, it was like the universe had to intervene. This love is like completely activated your heart. So the journey of the heart, that gateway to the high dimensions. You are on this powerful path together of ascension. But now it's like you're um, surrendering, consciously surrendering a lot of things to leave more room for the truth, which is love to leave more room for peace and harmony within your connection. Yeah, look, here's that lightning bolt. I have so much fear right now. This is the crumbling. It could have been a lot of family situations or anything that's been built up in a 3D that wasn't serving. Here's the lightning bolt to break down that density like the tower card. And you both have felt very fearful. Um, Many of you, you're moving through this or past this fear now because you're in the love vibration. You know you're indestructible. You are the infinite power of love. But yeah, they they want to support you um, to come out of fear and be in the vibration of love and joy. And this is the stability that they are creating for you. And this is what you do for them as well. You are these divine partners helping each other move over that bridge to the fifth dimension, the new earth. Yeah, look, opening up. Here are the depths of my heart and soul. Opening your hearts, being vulnerable. This was your biggest challenge for both of you your whole lives, okay? This was the challenge that you set for yourselves before incarnating, going through a lot of harshness, carrying a lot of that density, that um, shadow, those wounds, and then your souls agree that you would meet, it would activate your hearts, so you'd be able to shift out of those shadows, this is you being these alchemists, you wanted to hold a lot of shadow and then transmute it, this is also how you're helping to release the shadow um, from this false matrix. So what else do they really need you to know right now? How do they truly feel about you? <clears throat> Your soul is beautiful. Yes, you recognized each other's light. This is so profound and vitally important because you both were hiding yourselves away. Um, a lot of people, you know, you are these empaths. You may have come across a lot of narcissistic people in your lives. 
who have tried to drain your energy, dim your light, make you feel bad about yourselves. So you are hiding your beautiful souls away, feeling like there was something wrong with you. And ultimately you felt broken and flawed and because you felt so misunderstood as well. But then you've met your match. You've met your mirror in each other and you're both blinded by the beautiful light and um, because you love each other so much completely for who you truly are it's helping you both have that self-esteem to enable you to love yourselves completely and come out from those walls those chains that prison of fear look at the bottom of the deck i can't hold back any longer this is you both shining brightly breaking free moving to this deeper level of intimacy union um, open your hearts to each other i got zero sleep so yeah this really is a divine shake-up there's a lot of anxiety that you and your person could be feeling right now having some sleepless nights i have so much fear right now because some sort of comfort zone that ultimately wasn't serving them is crumbling away so it's coming out of that comfort zone it's feeling very vulnerable but you are both this um love bubble of love to help you but help you both transition and um, to align with the love the higher vibration higher levels of consciousness i hope you like what i'm planning so they're planning something and um, this is something mysterious that you may not know about there's something it's to do with opening the heart, I feel. So I'm going to continue this reading on in an extended reading. We're going to start off by looking at what is this person planning? What is going to happen next? We're also going to look at lots of messages cards to see what does your person really need you to know right now about their true feelings? What are they going to open up to you uh, about and say to you? And also lots of very detailed messages from spirit are going to come through. So the details for the extended reading are below this video in the description box and in the pinned comments i really hope to see you over there if this reading has resonated with you please let me know in the comments give it a thumbs up share it subscribe that all really helps me out with the algorithm thank you so much for joining me here and i hope to see you over on the extended